Thanks for watching See More Baltimore. I'm your host, Erica Lasan. The city of Baltimore was established in 1729, and since then, a lot of things have changed. The city has gone through a variety of nicknames, including Clipper City, the city that reads, and even the greatest city in America. But one nickname has always remained, Charm City. Come along with me as we introduce you to some of the city's newest businesses, some of its historical sites, new tastemakers, and all of the other things that make this great city charming. Being that Baltimore has been established for so long, it's obvious that there's a lot of history here. But did you know that Baltimore is a city of firsts? Come along with us as we speak with some people and see if they know just how many firsts occurred right here in Baltimore City. Where do you think snowballs were invented? I don't fucking know. Sky? A snowball? Yeah. You know what a snowball is? The syrup. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Baltimore? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> do you know where the first ever cathedral in the U.S. was built? Romano. Ah, here in Baltimore, yes, ding, yes. Ding, 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 ding. Where do you think the first dental school in the world was established? University of Maryland? Mm, I want to give you a guess again. Give me a city. Baltimore. Ding, 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 ding. Do you know where the first ever telegraph were sent from? Um, California? No, it's it would be Bell, and Bell was in the Northeast, so it's, it's I think it's Pennsylvania. Is that your last and final answer? Yes. Because William Bell, <laughs> William, it's, it's also a trivia show about Maryland, so wouldn't it be Baltimore? Bella, I, I, I try to think about Bell. Bell or Maryland, that's my final answer. That's not the answer, that's not the answer. <laughs> so we're half right. Hey, ding, ding, dong, I don't know. It's actually Baltimore. <laughs> Where do you think w the first street lights were used? Baltimore. Oh my gosh, you are indeed correct. I didn't know that. Right? Baltimore gets it on and popping. Clearly. Did you know that the National Aquarium of Baltimore is the first ever? National Aquarium. So 100 I'm 110% sure that's true. Yes, that is 100% true. Like, I was supposed to say, did it, do you know when that happened, though? No idea. I'm not going to lie. Um, 1908. No, I don't think it was that far. I think it happened. <laughs> right, how about like, 1965? No, it's not that far back. Not that not far that, back? Not that far back. 1970s, when? We think. The whole 10 years, though, the whole 70s. <laughs> but you know what? You both could be right, but I'm, I, I don't know because I don't have the answer. <laughs> We could just ask Google right now. The National Aquarium in Baltimore opened to the public on August 8th, 1981. I really wish I stuck with the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't have a prize to give you, so it's okay. All I got to give you is this knowledge. <laughs> Do you know where the first umbrella factory in the U.S. was built? In Baltimore. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ready, ready, another question. But okay. you like, we got to end on a positive note. I, I like that. Do you know where the Star Spangled Banner was written? Fort McHenry! Yes! Ding, 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 ding! Success! Success! Look at this victory dance! <laughs>